Welcome back to the channel. Another episode of Hitman for Dummies. We're going to do a little change of pace here. We're not going to kill anybody. We're going to be in Dubai, and this is going to be my shortcut tutorial. Uh, the loadout's really irrelevant. You don't really need it, but I selected a baton, uh, coin for distraction, silenced weapon. We're starting the lobby. That's pretty much it, but uh, we won't be killing anybody. Not a single soul. What we're going to do is we're going to. Uh, On behalf of His Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali, I... what we're going to do is we're going to. I'm going to show you where all the shortcuts are and how to open them. So you're going to climb up here. Of course, this will be a, a roundabout way because even I wasn't. I'm not really adjusted to this map yet. That's Marcus Stuyvesant, Providence partner, self-entitled and arrogant little worm. He might not look like much. <laughs> But he's done more damage to the world. No, I'm choosing to uh, subdue, subdue this guard here. I'm not sure why I chose to do that. I just decided to get him out of the way because I'm going to be going down the steps and wandering around. So we got to hide his body. I'm going to try to keep it a sound assassin rating. Though I don't do anything. Jeff stole his disguise, but. Uh, Exit out here. Now what we want to do is get the crowbar. No spotted by that guy. Suspicious, but he doesn't come over. We're gonna go upstairs. And one of our targets is still coming this way, so we gotta move quickly. Or just uh, wait for the pass. Excuse me. I've talked to one of your people inside the exhibition. Let's go up. Go up the ladder. And there's the closest crowbar is over by the uh, technical guys on the upper level. God, all this talking is really irritating. Climb over here, don't get spotted by that fellow. You can do all this without... Uh, for some stupid reason, I chose to go through here. Figure the guy would have spotted me and come to investigate. I didn't hear he doesn't. You can see him on the map going back to the water cooler. So let's knock out this fellow. We're gonna drag him into here. We're gonna steal his disguise just to make it easier on ourselves. Crowbar you wanna keep. Now this is me doing it from memory, but it's been a while since I've Played this, so my memory is not as good as I thought it was. Now I'm assuming there's one over here, which is sort of the truth, but yeah. I can't access it from here. I didn't like her, so. Truth is, I actually wanted her key. 47. I would like to address the Providence partners directly. You need to do what you... I want them to know why this is happening. You, you do what you want, and buddy. I have an idea, but it requires you finding a map, Taman. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You kind of don't really need to do all this hiding and stuff, but... For some reason, I want to keep Silent Assassin. Now, come out here, and can't see it because I'm not it up, but uh, one of the ladders is actually right behind us, but you have to break it open from the top, so wasting our time here. Here's where I start trying to uh, use the brain cells to remember where everything is. Yeah, that guy's not going to notice me. All these, inf I don't know why I bother coming in here. Yeah, I decided to get his uniform, so uh, I'm gonna whip out the uh, crowbar and just toss out of his head. It's funny, I hate the doors shutting automatically, it drives me nuts. Take the key card, you're gonna need that. And take his disguise, and we're just gonna dump him in there. Pick 
click out if you so desire. Like all the stuff I'm doing is just for my own edification. Here's our first shortcut. Now I realize those two guys are both enforcers. Interesting. So we're going to go up to the penthouse. Greetings, sir. Now there's one on the deck. There's four shortcuts. And there's one on the deck out here. Well, the, uh, the exterior deck. I'll just jump over there. I don't want to dis get distracted by uh, want the guards to you know be suspicious of you like jumping around like a monkey. Now on this exterior uh, deck here. Is an, and that's where the second shortcut is. I go down to figure out where I am, and that's when I realized, oh yes. And I even uh, go back outside and this. Is there a good place to sniper from? Uh... So, now here's me thinking, you know what? I gotta get to the third one, and it's better from the penthouse, so we're gonna go back up. The reason why I'm doing this is because I'm going to start doing the uh, Seven Sins DLC and I noticed when I did the first level, uh, I hadn't done the uh, shortcuts. Yeah, no door there. And what you want to do is go to uh, this door here. And here's number three. As far as I know, there's only four shortcuts. The last one is the one that's going to be the hardest one to find. So I decide I'm just going to go down here. It's in the, uh, you know, the fastest way down. I thought maybe I could jump it, but it's probably too high. So climb down here and you can grab onto the pipe there. But, I mean, for the most part, you're safe here. You're trespassing, but you're in disguise. So. Be on the lookout for white dots on the map, on the little mini map for uh, forcers. And here's me trying to figure out how to get to the. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I got rid of this guy, because I don't know. I'm sure there's a faster way to get to the last uh, shortcut. It's hoping that we keep going down this way and you'll get to it, but uh, I'm wrong. Done. I think I can open that window remotely. Good for you. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. See, I've already opened all the elevator doors. So we're going to go here. And that leads us to... We're in a good position. Problem is I don't have the right key card. And therefore... This is the last uh, shortcut is is on the side of the map. As I said, I don't have the right key card in that. I figure that out uh, pretty quickly. But go up these stairs. And what you want to do is... The door is not over here. I don't believe it is. I could be mistaken. Yeah, this is me. This is me pulling everybody's chain a little, wasting each other's time. So I know there's a door, and there it is, making it. But I don't have the right key card. And here's me trying to figure out how to get to it. That's when I remembered bathroom attendants. All the bathroom attendants. This is also me trying to figure out how to get back to where I started. Go down here, and there's a bathroom just this way. So the bathroom attendants have the right uh, key card. Hi there, sir. 
Here's me double checking. No, the Pandas key card doesn't do anything. So what you want to do is get a key card, and you're gonna to want to just toss a coin in there, and distract the guy, get him in here. Can you go and see what on earth that was, please? I hear you. Shut the door so she doesn't see you. There's no place to hide the body, but uh, and there's the key card, the precious key card. Here's me looking around like, wait, there's no place to hide this guy. Shut the door so she goes and see the body. Come through here. And the other maintenance door is like up the stairs, I think. And this lady, you see her, you know you're there. Because she's going to be one of our targets in the uh, greed uh, escalation. And here we go. Unlock the door. Boom. Got the last shortcut. And we're going to call it a day. That's it. A little long and winding. Sorry about that. But uh, until next time, check you guys later.